So as you guys saw in that little intro, the Pedal Commander finally came in. Uh, only a couple days shipping. I did delay on purchasing it, guys, just because I didn't know what this whole uh, virus thing going on about job situation and stuff. But I did pick it up, and it's actually significantly smaller than how I thought. There it is compared to my phone. Very small, not as big as the Sprint Booster, but this is the one that won on the video of Pedal Commander versus Sprint Booster, which one you guys wanted to see to enhance the throttle of my 4Runner. So this video isn't gonna be the install video that's either gonna come out tomorrow or this weekend for you guys. This one is mainly gonna be why did it take me so long to get the Pedal Commander and why did I finally choose to do this? So I'll start off by saying I didn't wanna do any type of throttle enhancing thing. Uh, you're unplugging your throttle cable which is now electronic in these vehicles. And long story short about electronic throttles, you can't just mash the pedal down and it do the same thing as this. So the people that comment that, uh, I don't feel have a full understanding of how a electronic throttle body actually reacts. Uh, Sprint Booster actually did a very good video showing how quickly the throttle body actually opens on electronic throttles. Even if you mash it down, yes, it's gonna finally get up and go, but this is different. One of the reasons why I was so against this is just because I heard a lot of just bad things, right? I heard a lot of bad things about the Sprint Booster, Pedal Commander, you're unplugging your OEM wire uh, to put in this third-party device, which is kind of sketchy. However, a ton of people rant and rave and praise these products, and they've been out for a good while now. So I figured, what the heck, if the demand is there from you guys, the viewers, then I will pick it up. I went with new as well. This is brand new, in the box, got it off of Amazon uh, because it was quicker shipping. I'll leave a link down in the description if you guys wanna check it out right now just to get an idea about it. It was $300. I did not reach out to the company. I did not buy it used from one of you guys, although thank you so much for offering it used. I wanted a completely unbiased opinion, right? So if this thing sucks, it messes up, I know it was brand new. And I can let you guys know that it, it's not if it messes up, maybe it was the other owner, anything like that, or hey, they sent me a faulty product and they don't want me to review it if it was faulty, unbiased opinion coming up. So I'm very excited to do this. Uh, I already have a few videos in mind. I want to check out how one, you know, obviously how the throttle response actually is. I do have an SMB cold air intake in my vehicle. It has helped some throttle response, not a crazy amount, but I'm sure that this will do it and also other videos of MPG with it, putting this thing in Sport Plus Plus 4 and not telling the wife and having her drive it, but a, lo a lot of videos uh, to come for this. So it will be installed. I will do a how-to install video, first reactions, and more videos to come. So if you guys are looking forward to this, please consider subscribing. I would highly appreciate it, and I will catch you all in the next video. All right, see you guys later.